Now, is your pet safe today? Do you know where they are, what they're doing? Uh, dog thefts are reaching an all-time high in the UK now, around five dogs stolen every day. Um, and it's not an offence. Why is it not moment, an offence? Because a dog is, is, not, is considered a thing. So it's the, the penalty for stealing a dog is the same as it would be for stealing a bike or a... Mm. Mm -hmm. something inanimate. Well, a man that wants to change all of that is dog behaviourist. He's Stan Rawlinson, and he's campaigning for a change in the law. And uh, before we speak to Stan, uh, we're going to talk to Jackie Milson because she's been through all of this. Uh, two lovely dogs from you, Jackie, uh, in... Is it Barnsley? Is that where you live? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. you're in Barnsley. Tell us, what, tell us what happened to Zala and Zeus. Now, Zala, as we're going to see here, on the left is the Siberian Husky. Zeus... German Shepherd, not easy dogs. Actually, I'm, no, I'm wrong, I'm wrong. The other way about, okay, right. yes, yes. Zeus doesn't look a typical German Shepherd there, <laughs> uh, does, does he? Yeah, <laughs> very distinctive then. Very. And you would have thought easy to spot or yeah. somebody would know where Zeus is. Yeah, um, I'm sure somebody does. Um, I went out uh, for a doctor's appointment. I used to leave the back door open so the dogs could go in or out um, in a quiet village. I'd done it for many years. In a, in a secure guard? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. very secure with a husky. Yeah. Um, and I uh, was gone about an hour. I came home and they weren't there. Um, they would normally have run up to the gate mm. to acknowledge the car pulling up and they didn't. But I just sort of, you know, went in the house, went through, the gate had been broken and they were gone. So someone knew what they were after. They'd been looking at your dogs for a while and they obviously knew there was a market for them. Possibly. It, I, I, I Did you think changed... at that point they'd been stolen or they just escaped? Or... I knew they'd been stolen, but, yeah, I still sort of ran up and down the street, if that makes looking, sense, because yeah. I was just sort of in shock. The main thing is when you go and you report all this to the police, they don't want to know. No. I got a crime reference number um, and that was it. Right. So That's they didn't it. follow up, nobody came no, to see you? No, no, nobody came. Stan, so, why are people stealing dogs like this? Are they stealing them um, for ransom? Are they stealing them to sell on? Are they stealing them just to have? Or breeding? Well, part of that, uh, they're doing it for breeding, but a lot less now because we've brought in the new microchipping laws quite recently that uh, means that every dog has got to be microchipped. What we now have to do is make sure that everyone scans them when they well, go to the vets and things like that. Yeah. They were chipped, but yeah. as Stan says, it's the law that we have them chipped, but it's not the law that the vets scan every new dog that goes into their practice. And without them doing that, people like myself have got less chance of getting them back. Um, the, the figure I was quoting there was it's five dogs stolen every day. Do you think that's a realistic figure or do you no, think it's more? No, I think it's a totally oh. unrealistic figure. I think it's a minimum of ten times more than that. Ten and times a, more? Wow. Minimum. Uh, really is, because this is big money. There's organised gangs being involved now in dog theft for some considerable time. I don't know whether you know, but go back to Dickens in time and there was an enormous raft of dog thefts at that time. But there was only very rich people had puppies. Now we have eight and a half million dogs in this country. What's yeah. the so, penalty if you were caught stealing a dog? Now, about a slap and a wrist, the average fine is about £250. That, how can that possibly take into... A consideration that it's like fear. a member of the, the family. A, yeah, they're ripping a member of your family out of your home. They're, they're, they're taking away a family member. It doesn't just affect us, it affects the grandchildren, it affects everybody. It was three days before Christmas for us. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> and, and a number of years ago now, what, three years? It's, or so? It'll be three yeah. years in December. Um, tell us, Jackie, the, the pain and the anguish that you have gone through. I mean, this isn't just like having a bicycle stolen or something, because you're still looking oh. and you'll, you'll go on looking. Oh, I'll go on looking until it's absolutely impossible that they're no longer with us. I'll never stop. Um, have you been on, uh, had a campaign on Facebook? Oh, yeah. Have, there pictures um, there? have you had any leads at all? I, I get photos every day still, but they've just never been mine. Um, and Facebook's been amazing for me. It's 28,000 followers. I put that I was coming on here and 82,000 people have seen it. So thank you, because... You know, there's not just me, there's so many other people searching for their, their loved pets. Mm. But we've got to keep trying and I well, have to stay A positive. lot of people stand now, they're going to be very worried and they're going to think, oh, my goodness, if that happened to my animal, 
what can people do? What would you say is the best way of trying to ensure, trying to prevent this awful thing doesn't happen to them? OK, there are people watching you. It happens all the time. Thieves, but not, not just for that. But the money involved is unbelievable. And uh, you mentioned it before, uh, the reward. They'll go and claim the reward. And people say no questions asked. They're not interested that they'd stole the dog. Sure. They just want just the dog, want the dog, dog back. back. Ransom. Blackmail. Oh, I bought this dog in the pub uh, and I paid a £1,000 for it. I don't want to lose my money if you want it back. That sort of thing. But there's also... They're stealing him as bait for dog fighting. Oh, goodness. That doesn't bear thinking about why. Well, that's what mentality Jackie, allows someone yeah. to want to do something like that? Jackie, Can now you hearing that, you're getting visibly upset yeah. now, just even thinking that that would be a possibility. Yeah. Yeah. I'd, I'd like to think, because of the breeds that mine were, they perhaps wouldn't be as... A, a target for fighting as much, maybe more for breeding. I choose to think that somebody bought them not knowing, they haven't got social media and they're living a fantastic life in the country somewhere. I'm not that unrealistic, but no. it's the but only way to get through. through. That gets you yeah. through. Yeah. 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 Um, we've said we've got to keep our pets by our sides, not yeah. out of our sides, don't be... leave them outside alone. What you want yeah. you to do? Change your route that you walk a dog on a day-to-day -day basis. Make sure you're, you've got cameras up in your back, back mm. garden and things like that. Secure everything. Make sure the back door can't easily to be yeah. getting into. But they'd steal out them out of the car. They'll steal them. Think... We've had a dog called Sebi stolen just from us. Yeah. Uh, at the back of where I live is a, is a large uh, park called Hathrop Park. He'd taken his 12-week puppy out there called Sebi and uh, he turned round to this other dog to pick the poo up. The puppy had gone into a bush, no. never came out. Someone on the other side has grabbed it, yeah. got it by his thing oh, and well, legged uh, it. They well, haven't Jackie, got it back. We hope, that we hope by showing the pictures of yeah, your thank dog, you Sala and Zoo, somebody, mm. might, somebody might know where they are Hopefully. and get in touch. Uh, and Stan, thank you very much. It's and, definitely and good luck with all the us. work that you're trying to do. Well, if okay. anyone can, uh, go on to uh, Google and type in dramatic rise in dog theft. The first one on there will show the petition that I've, I've taken. We've got... Uh, Sign it. Uh, we've got 306,000 okay. okay. signatures already. Right. Thanks, Dan. Thank you. Thank you.